Okay, hi. Um, I'm going to show you how to install um, App Planet um, so you can download apps to your Impression i1080 tablet. It'll work on pretty much any Android tablet. Um, you can see I'm running, I've also already installed, and by the way, this is a application called WebKey that I'm running. And as you can see, I'm running this from my PC, so I have Sony Vio, and um, I'm remotely connected to my tablet, and I'm running um, an application called Microsoft Expression, which is allowing me to capture video of my screen as I'm. So I have my my Android tablet connected um, via this uh, application WebKey and um, I'm capturing my screen so pretty nice to do how-to videos so uh, you can see I have the Android market on my computer tablet and I got that by going to the XDA developers website and there's uh, instructions out there and if I can I will I'll show you how to do that uh, in another video um, but for now I'm going to show you a very similar market that you can use to get applications on and you can see here's your startup screen that you get. Now, if you go to your browser, just click on your browser. Um, and you can see I had Facebook open, and that's another thing that I've seen a lot of posts about Facebook. You can run Facebook directly from your your, your browser in the same manner that you can run um, uh, Pandora as well directly from your web browser. So I'm going to cut. See, I'm, I'm running this through my, my um, I'm running this through my computer, so I'm gonna, it's going to be a little slower by doing it this method. So I'm going to go to um, H. down here where it says download I'm just going to click on download and it will take a few seconds to work but it will say starting download and you will see up here when, whenever you download applications to your tablet you will see a little down arrow and there's actually a, it's, it's a bar that's here and it's, it's uh, transparent because it's black but if you drag that down you will see that I'm running WebKey, which is the software program I told you about. And also, I've got now this connection, and this bar is going across here, and it's making a connection to App Planet. And um, it, it's going to be a little slower uh, when you're initially doing this. Uh, it takes a takes a couple minutes, but just be patient. Now I am limited to, uh, I'm using this Microsoft Expression um, software to capture my screen, and if the video times out, it'll time out after 10 minutes, but you can see now I've got this app that's starting to download. All Android applications have an extension of .apk, so uh, you can see, I mean, I've already actually downloaded this app a couple times, so that's why it's got AP app 2. Yours is just going to say app.apk if it's your first time doing it. But and, uh, Once 
once it's in, once it's fully downloaded, it should install. And then this market is kind of a um, is very similar to the old Android market in that it has up-to-date applications in, in there, but it's it doesn't have the um, the interface that the Android market has, which is a is a much nicer interface. If you go to the uh, Google Market or the Android Market through Google, you'll see it through the web, and I'm, I'm going to show you that as well. So uh, should be almost done. done so I'm going to open it and it's going to give you this new server thanks for waiting they just upgraded this uh, and there you go and if you if you take a look at the way this is formatted it looks almost identical to the Android market in the manner that it used to look but now the Android market looks a lot different but it still has the same map so uh, there are tons of apps out here that you can download. So you want to get Facebook. Installed or App Planet installed, you can then go to your web browser 